and what is up guys it's Kovian here and um yeah never thought i'd make this video but here we are we are here um i mean this video is more of i'm gonna speak about my uh my transition so for those who know my channel this channel was called dislight Kovian dislight and i had gaius and hide on my banner that will no longer be the case so i have rebranded i have myself there that is me and i just have Kovian. so i'm no longer Kovian dislight it is just Kovian. and <clears throat> i mean it's a somber feeling man like there's a reason why i am connected i had connected the dislight to the Kovian, right and um it's because i believe in the game this like a lot right and i just want to point you out guys to this video it's a one hour rant done by aeon you know shout out to aeon every time and a lot of things he said is a lot of things i believed um a bit of background i played um three years of epic seven um and i played one year of raid raid shadow legends right um, I left Epic 7 <clears throat> for Dislight, but Raid, I just left it because Epic 7 was just a better game. And I don't mean like graphic wise or something really doesn't matter much, but it's that Epic 7 had introduced RTA and I just like, I just liked Epic 7 at the time, you know, I was a big enough spender to reach legend in Epic 7 right and it was cool for a while until until it wasn't right until the game was just um broken to unrecognizable um levels right and this light came out in fact the honor server and this is why this one hour run to resonate so much with me because i came in with the same outlook as ion as ion this light was going to be the next frontier i really believed this light would surpass um summoner's war would surpass racial legends and would easily surpass epic 7 it would have a competent pvp system whereby we can use competent units you know that not only look good but play good right and i saw a unit like hide i haven't seen hide in any other game again i didn't play someone as war some people tell me there's a unit like hide but like just the unique kits and i fell in love right and i was like bro this game this is the truth this is the truth i am backing this horse little did i know i'm backing a donkey but i was like i am backing this horse and i started youtube for the very first time right i, I always watched youtube i was always around the youtube space right even back when i played wow in like 2006 and um yeah cataclysm shout out to the people who played um <laughs> but i i just always did that right i also played card game Hearthstone was big for me at the time but i just like whenever i played those even the digital games i never thought of making a youtube channel until this light so i had to go with korean this light so this rant is the perspective of anyone who joined this light um during the honor server right we tested this game for these people right and we had all so many ideas you can do this with this content you can do that with this content you can do this with this content right and um i feel like the people we told those ideas from are no longer part of lilith or farlight i don't care like who are no longer making this light they are no longer the people making the decisions for this light it's, it's a different group of people so um yeah this video <clears throat> just yeah go check it out pretty cool by aeon it's it's very cathartic right and um that's one of the reasons right it's like actually, actually this video um i'm not sure this was aeon's point but what i got from this video is that i should stop trying to make this like the game that i want and accept reality come back to reality and realize that the game is what it is <laughs> right like it is what it is like i can fantasize the game all i want and romanticize it in my brain but that's just not the game that we are given right it is the game that we are given is the one we're playing now and it's half baked 
is Ben Huff baked for this is not two months, three months, almost six months. So yeah. And another thing, shout out to Dairy Free to play as well. Um, I don't want to mention stuff that happened like you know, behind closed doors and stuff like that. But this, his second comment, is the other thing that gave me the wake up call, <clears throat> right? Because this is straight up true. So he made a post, sort of addressing the people, calling him like a shill or something like that, right? Or he said sorry, the people who misunderstood his one video where he was sarcastically you know apologizing for something that's but again not the point uh this point he says secondly the fate of the game is fixed there's no way they can recover from this they'll forever be known for resorting to lazy tactics and the one long year we waited for was in vain even if they backtracked and somehow squeezed in co-op mode it is way too late facts even if they give us the actual rta it is way too late facts even if they fixed hollow but like they played their card and showed how little love they had for dislike shade mother andrew skins events celestial anomaly we will always remember them. guys this feels like a student like this patch feels like a student who just wanted to send in his assignment because it is required right like if you were a diligent student which i was right i studied chemical engineering and i have passion for it, right i'm even at work right F fuck fuck back in school even at work like when i'm reporting something i try to make sure that i am proud of the thing that i'm about to present to people like can the dev who made this say i am proud to say i brought shade mother to the masses i brought back rta i gave them andros i made the skin for the red tree like are they really proud of what they made no like if this patch was like my work bro i wouldn't be proud of this i wouldn't definitely wouldn't and this will stick this will stick even if they rectify it it will stick we'll remember it's like when you like cheat so much on your girlfriend right and like she keeps on forgiving you like every time she forgives you she cares less and less and that's where we are right and this is the last part i'm embarrassed i had given this light um four to five chances through all these numerous bad decisions but one thing i can say for sure that isn't a false rumor is this afk arena is run by the same publisher farlight and i will not touch that shit there we go and i also won't touch that shit also shout out to zox bringing light to all of this um i just watched this video and he mentioned something important we should all stick together as um content creators there shouldn't be anyone who's out there being saying like hey, yo i'm actually happy for andrews let's go no we aren't happy it's a bad patch we all know this and the sad part is i think this light knows this they threw this out as you know just fuck it and they thought we would accept it everyone should let them know this is unacceptable they're fooling no one that's not shade mother that is not the fourth ritual miracle boss you have done nothing to fix rta you have done nothing to fix holo battle you have done nothing to balance the game. You have done nothing to bring competent, interactive, and rewarding gameplay to this life. And yeah, finally, I am rebranding. Am I quitting this light? Not yet. Not yet. Again, I always said there's guys in my comments when I make a rant video that say, Kovian, why the fuck do you still play this game? And it's mainly because I was romanticizing the game in my head. RTA is coming. Co-op Shade Mother's coming. Oh shit, they don't know. The devs are about to go in. They don't know. Balance is coming. Just give them time. Give them time, Kovian. Give them time. There's money. There's everything. It's Lilith. They're loaded. They will funnel AFK Arena money into this light. No, no, no. I got it all wrong. 
AFK is the actual golden child. And with AFK 2, we are seeing that. Things we wanted in this life for so long, they exist rent free in AFK 2. They just exist. Um, so I'll be rebranding. I will still upload videos for this light. Um, Andros is out. He's here. Um, people who want to farm Andros, I will give you Andros guides. I will give you shade mother guides. Um, I will do RTA streams. I will do RTA guides up until to the point where I open the game and I'm just like, fuck it. I don't care. Right. I don't know when that is. I don't know if the game will get better, but one of these patches will break me, right? This one has led me to this point. I have removed this light. I'm no longer married to this light. This channel could continue doing this light or it could do something else. I am open to anything at this point. And that is the point of the video. Um, thank you for watching, guys. I um, never thought I'd make a video like this, but here we are. Um, anyone who still sticks around, again not quitting this light not yet um it can it be it can but it's like it's gonna be a weird like this light can turn this around but it's gonna be a weird relationship because i'm that one mistake will make me more angry because of all these mistakes in the past right like i said it's like a relationship with a boyfriend and a girlfriend if the girlfriend has been cheating the guy accepting the girl back every mistake the girl makes is multiplied by 100 even if it's not that bad it becomes awful because the guy is keeping all the memories of like all the bad things she's done in the past right so yeah it's gonna become toxic and um i guess we are here for it but aeon's video the the final rant right again I'm gonna prove to you guys that I was ranting because I love this game. I don't love this light anymore. No more rant videos for me. No more rant videos. I am done. It can burn, it can do whatever. I'm not invested. This has been Kovian. Thank you for watching. And I'll see you in the next video. This is.